Gefüge, in German it's Gefüge, in English I translate it as structure, which is not really true, it's more like disposition. It's actually, the idea came from this thing, you enter a room and there is some certain thing in the room, you cannot really name it. It's coming from different influences, from social constellations, from circumstances, from mood, from the whole feeling of the room. And then I started to work with capacity sensors, which are actually based on the fact that um, there is an electric load, and if you approach something, you change the load. And this is how you can create touch sensors. And actually, also all cell phones are working like with this technology, with the technology of capacity. And then these two ideas mixed in my brain, and I had this idea of creating a huge capacity sensor that is actually sensing little changes in the electric field. And for this time, the, and I, I, I chose a material that I like, especially this uh, metal mesh, because for me, it, is also, it has this layer of a drawing of something graphical, actually. It's black and white, and it is, the shadows are built in like some fine line uh, drawings, and little structures, they are always like changing a little bit. And so finally I somehow created this amorphous object that is having this organic movement, this breathing. And it's doing actually what it does, it's breathing, but it's changing its movement, his or her or its movement, I don't know, uh, through the influences from sounds and through the influences from the electric field that is changing. So this time it was super interesting because I took also sound into it because it's it was resonating also with Noit's object, because when he was playing the cello, or when the drums are reacting, also this object is very much reacting. That's why I included a sound in the concept for the exhibition of the structure this time. And yeah, it's actually, actually the first time it is really shown like this. I built a prototype like one year ago, which was also exhibited. But uh, this is now actually the first time that I'm showing like a more finished version.